As Nigerians an anxiously await the outcome of the tightly contested presidential elections, the head of the ECOWAS observation mission, Ernest Korama, says the voting process was marred by irregularities. He noted the late start of voting beyond the 8.30 a.m. opening time due to late arrival of pulling officials, voting materials, and in some cases the delivery of wrong materials at pulling stations across the country. The Electoral Observation Mission of the European Union on Monday presented a preliminary report of its observations of Nigeria's 2023 general elections at a press conference held at the Transcap Hilton. Abuja, chief observer of the mission, Barry Andrews, for the said the elections was, were met by widespread allegations of vote buying, disinformation of voters, and a lack of planning in critical stages of the electoral process. While commending citizens for the turnout at the polls, Andrews stated that the EU would continue to monitor the collation of results as well as the March 11 governorship and state assembly elections and would present its final report three months after the end of the election processes in order not to interfere with the process. That expectations as the, the way the technology would transform the transparency of the election, those expectations were not met in a significant number of cases. Um, the operation of the BVAS machines was not um, uh, it was significantly impaired in certain areas. Uh, we noted the operation of IREV during the course of the evening wasn't what was expected. Um, we noted that in some instances the uh, offline uploading of uh, results onto BVAS machines was not done systematically. Uh, so there were other issues that, that we noted and, uh, but we don't do them on a uh, polling unit per polling unit basis. We simply did it across all of the observations that we obtained across the entire country. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.